Hello again, everyone. My name is Uncle Steve, and I just realized I went through the wrong door. So give me a second. All right, let's try this again. <laughs> Hell of an opening, right? All right. There we go. That's more like it. I have to go... Oh, you know what? I have the firepower now. Wasn't there something in here? <gasps> there was. All right, now that that's... Uh... Uh, oh. Wait. Am I allowed to be down here? Oh, don't tell me it's spiders. Yup. Lots of spiders. Okay, note to self. Try not to break the egg sacs. Though it looks like I might have to break at least a few of them. Or I could skip them. Good to know. Wait. I need what's over there. So, uh... Actually, damn. Maybe it's worth breaking the egg sacs. Let's me get in there. You know? Lots of souls and whatnot. Okay, this could not have gone worse. And we fixed it. Everything's fine. Hey, cool. The door open on there, over there opened. Uh, we'll go deal with that in just a moment. There's a ladder here. And I kind of want to see what the ladder goes. Or what it do. Hey. Nothing over there. Let's open the lever, though. I have a feeling I know where this is going to open up. Yeah, okay. Good to know. Uh, do the XX respawn? So far, the answer is no, so that's probably a good thing. Alright, what else is down here? Or is this some kind of, like, bonus dungeon I'm not supposed to be down here for? Yeah! That's right. Take it. <laughs> yeah. Oops. I fell. Did I break this stuff? No, okay. I like that, though. But I guess we'll continue on our journey. Whee! Uh, wait, wait, oh, okay. This is okay, never mind. Still fine. Still fine. Oh, okay, okay. I don't know how I feel about these, though. The poison boys? Alright. Oh, you're biggin'. Why are you so big? I don't like you big. Ow. There goes the big guy. 
And of course the big guy spawns some more spiders. It's like real spiders, just spiders and spiders and spiders. Just Russian doll, Russian doll spiders. Which honestly is a bit of a terrifying thought to think about. Just imagine, you crush a spider and a smaller spider comes out of it. You crush that one and a smaller spider comes out of it. Okay, I don't have anything I can use really to do any of that, I think, so we'll come back. Yeah, that one got stuck. Bye. Okay. Wait, what's this? Got an old compass. It occasionally twitches and turns of its own whims. It's clearly very old. Perhaps the magnetism inside it has mostly worn away. Cool. Broken compass. It's like if you go on like an adventure or something. Like someone takes you for like a vacation or something. And you get one of those toys or you get something to take it with you. And it's just like, yay, it's a cruddy broken compass. Also just realized I'm going the wrong way to get out of here. <laughs> but yay. Thanks. Got all these dead spiders. <laughs> All right, so, note to self. Come back here later when we have stuff. I will say I do have a major amount of backtracking to do in this game, but that'll be later. Yeah, you can't get me, can you? Bye. I think I'm going the right way, right? Yeah. Wait, what's over here? Overgrown ruins. All right, before we do that, I think I think the game wants me to deliver the soul. I think I could be completely wrong about that, but I'm gonna do it anyway. I don't have a seed to plant. How's it going there, bud? Incredible. Oh, I'm sorry. Hold on. You have already achieved more in this short time than I was able in countless years. If you can reap the souls of the other two giants, we can open Death's door. I suggest you head east, beyond the woods. There, a self-proclaimed king reigns over the ruins of a flooded cathedral tormenting the denizens of the forest. Okay. Guess, guess I'm gonna go do that. Oh, bye. Guess, guess it's like, bye, Grandpa. I suppose, technically speaking, Grandpa's dead. The one Grandpa that is. Um... Okay, so... I have to figure out where the hell I'm going to go. Uh, was there anything in here I missed? No. Okay. No, 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 no. Never mind. Pardon me. It might be a minute or two for me to find out where the hell I'm going, so if this goes too long, I'll catch you guys. Oh, never mind. I found it. <laughs> As I'm talking, I find it. I think. Something down there. There are things down here. Is this another shortcut thing? Okay, I can't actually go there yet. Okay, never mind. Just wasting more time. Alright. So... I always enjoy kind of games like this where you have to backtrack and do certain stuff if you have the right equipment. Alright, so this is definitely the right way. Pretty sure. Oh, hey, look, the plants and whatnot we saw downstairs in the spiders. I saw a seed. Give me that seed. Don't take that out of context. If you do, that's weird. Also... 
All right, birds can't swim. Good to know. And by that, I mean these birds can't swim. And by that, I mean this bird can't swim. By that, I mean I'm an idiot. There are a lot of these anchor things. I'm hoping that, like... Wait, are you alive or are you just a... Okay, no, you're just a tower of some kind. All right, so we'll ignore that. Uh, nothing over there. It definitely feels like there's a lot of backtracking, though. Not that I'm complaining, but a lot of potential to explore. <gasps> Pothead! Hello again, Beakface. How goes your adventure? I'd like to stop by the stranded sailor to refresh my stocks of Jefferson's delicious soup. He's an odd fellow, but a great chef. Alright, cool. Pothead's chilling with us. Nice to see he didn't just, you know, fall in depression. As you know, he did kind of kill- Ah, oh, there's a door! Activate door. Who are you? Drunk crow. Ah! Oh, Betty. My beautiful Betty. Uh, uh, is this the guy? You have soup? Is Jefferson? Okay, he is. He is dead as shit. Yeah, let me see if I can do this right. Greetings, fellow biped. My name is Jefferson, a humble bartender and seafood enthusiast. At your service. Would these human hands prepare you a delicious meal today? Yes. Great. One delicious meal coming right up. I sure do love preparing food with my multi-digited mammal hands. This is like a robot that says, I am human. Oh, okay. We just going into it, huh? Now tell me you a little something. Oh, well. Now, let me tell you a little something while you ingest nutrients. A secret lies submerged beneath the moat in the ur estate of the Urn Witch. Opening it will require bringing an open flame to the East Gardens. There's a lot going on in the Witch's basement even before you reach the Inner Furnace. A stray bull carriage may grant you access to its secrets. You look like a sprightly young biped. I'm sure you could get down through a sewer grate, right? I've heard there is a secret through a sewer pipe in the overgrown ruins. That's all I have for you now. I'm assuming. Oh. Uh. Okay. I'm assuming he's the, like the secret keeper in this kind of game. And this is where he sleeps. Also, he's selling like bits of squid, which is a little weird. This isn't he squid, so it's like he's selling his friends, or bits of his friends, or, dear god, possibly himself. Actually, does it count as cannibalism if you eat your own body? I think it does. I'm gonna need some kind of... I'm gonna need somebody to tell me about that one. Found an adventure journal. It is very damp. The pages seem to be stuck together. Well... Damp or sticky? I'm a, I'm a leave it by damp. Because I want to. And if it was the other thing, it'd be a little weird. Alright, it can't go that way, so. <laughs> Bird go whoosh. This way to the mountaintops. Castle Lockstone. Okay. And I don't think I can do anything over there. Alright, so I do have to go this way. If I can be a little bit smart and not run into the sign, that is. I don't know what that is, but I want it. Oh, I want that. Okay, good to know. Break the crystals. Can't do that either. All right. And the crystals... Reform. Okay. Huh. Can't go that way. Okay, can't go that way, can't go that way. And I just went up this way to go talk to our boy in the soup shop. Oh, did I go the wrong way? 
Honestly, I might have. What do you got to tell me, pothead? Hello again, Beakface. How goes your adventure? I'd like to stop by the blah 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 and eat soup. Alright, so. Soup man still talks about his soup. Okay. This might require a little bit of backtracking on my end, so I'll get you guys back once I figure out the next big thing to do. Till then, uh... I don't know, it'll happen like in five seconds, so see you then. Okay. So I think... I think maybe this is where I'm supposed to go. Maybe. I mean, it's a spot to light a lantern, so... Lantern lit. Yeah, okay, I remember the rope in the cutscene-looking thing, so that's definitely... This is definitely a way to go. I gotta hit a lot of these backtrack levers and stuff. Okay, nothing over there. I can't go anywhere further that way. Can't go up. Yet. To my knowledge. I can drop down, though, can I? Because there's an area over there I can just drop down on top of them. Yeah, here we go. Drop. Anything back here? No, okay. Ow. Okay. Overgrown rooms. Okay, so I think this is the way we are supposed to go. Oh! We got some Final Fantasy IX action going on here. Are you gonna stop here? You are. Yo, that guy's chill. Kind of like he, I kind of hope he likes his job. Damn, we are we are far away from home. Huh. All right. Is this to open the door or is this to Okay, that answers my question. Now yeah, this to open the door. Good to know. And I don't think I can do anything over there yet, because there's just a lot of water in the way. The overgrown ruins. Well, they weren't lying about that. Hey, doorway. Oh. Right. Wouldn't be a kind of game like this without at least one killer plant. Thankfully, though, it can't reach me. I'm going to assume that we're going to find the thing that lets us break these. Uh, what? Okay. Mm. Yeah, there's so many secrets I have to backtrack for. That's right. Get wrecked, nerd. What are you? Let me try something. Ah! <laughs> that worked. Oh, that's cool. All right, let's try this on this side then. No. I can't kill that. I can hit that from range, though, which is nice to see. Nah, I gotta do it the other way. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Okay, so you break rocks. Uh, was there anything that I could break with rocks here? Yes, there is. Oh, ho, ho, ho. All right, now, of course, the real question. What is the range on this thing? Hmm. 
No, okay, so it's got to be within the screen. All right, that's fair. That's fair. Oh, shit. Give me the plant. Give me the key. Ow. Dick. Okay, some killer plants. Plants that can shoot things at us. Plants that explode. Nice, actually got that off. Dick. Give me the seed. Smart. Okay, so that lets me drop down. But I don't want to drop down. I want to keep it going. Oh. It's way to the forest settlement. Wait, there's a settlement out here? You telling me there are peeps out here? Huh. Yeah! I don't know what the purpose of that was, but, you know, I did it. Huh. Ooh, who are you? Forest child! We used to explore the dungeons, but the forest sealed them up. The Frog King sat on my brother until his insides became his outsides. Okay. Hello, feathery person. I'm hard of hearing, so you will have to speak up. I can just not talk to you at all. What about you? What are you? I've not just seen your type in this land for a long, long time. You're probably here to see your friends in the depths below. I'm sorry. But the forest itself sealed the gates to the dungeons many moons ago to keep us safe. I could speak with her and perhaps sway her to open the gates for you. But we converse in song and sadly, I have lost my magic horn. I left it in the old camp to the north. Alas, we were driven from there by the Frog King's henchmen. If you return it to me, I am sure we can help you on your journey. You know what? We're going to find your horn. Next time. Everyone, thank you very much for watching. My name has been Uncle Steve. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe. Till next time, take care.